Hi dear friends welcome to top education in this session we are learning financial management chapter 3 financial decisions so here guys in this chapter only the thing you have to read is the one format which gives you 6 and 14 marks yes so let's know the format first and then we'll do our sums and all format of ebit ebit means earning before interest and tax sales the amount minus variable cost we can see variable cost as vc also then contribution fixed cost fc ebit the full form of ebit is earning before interest and tax then we will deduct interest or it can be debenture also so that uh, after detection what will get is known as ebit which is earning before tax then minusing tax guys if they have not given in the question about the tax information then you have to take 50% if they have given 45 35 then use that only if they have not given anything take 50% then eat earnings after tax then we here we deduct preference share and preference capital also maybe preference dividend also so that and then that after detecting that we will get ea esh that is earnings available to equity shareholders amount here we will go uh, will divide it by equity shares the final amount is there no will divide it by equity shares so what is this equity shares how will get us here we need the quantity one see 2000 shares in 210 so the 2000 we need 2000 here so we'll get eps by dividing this we'll get eps clear this you have to buy it keep in your mind which can give you 6 and 14 marks actually sales variable cost contribution fixed cost ebit interest debenture or something else ebit tax eat preference share capital and ea esh that is earnings available to equity shareholders divided by equity shares by dividing that you will get eps next you have types of leverages and the formula also we have this actually may be for 6 marks or 14 also 6 or 14 that will do will solve the sums you can understand what as that financial leverages fl ebit divided by ebt so ebit is this ebt is this take down here operating leverages ol contribution divided by ebit combined leverages by contribution divided by ebt earnings before tax so guys here you can see for 6 marks find leverages and do ebit okay done then for 14 marks find the leverages and ebit where project a and b is given ebit is 1 lakh ebit is 2 lakh or the question may be eps is equal to 1 2 3 or many other sums which may come so this types of questions comes actually in the question paper like find the leverages and ebit okay then again the question comes like project a and project b which is the best suggest then you have the ebit is 1 lakh and 2 lakh which eps is getting good prefer then eps the eps are given below find out ebit or do the leverages or do the sum so this you will use so this is guys the basic of this chapter actually this is the basic of this chapter we'll do sums in different different parts so we will be understanding better and clear okay guys thank you for watching this video if you like then please subscribe our channel top education thank you guys